Chapter 30. The animals gaped at me in astonishment. Even the youngest babies knew about the don't talk to people rule. Bongo darted to my top branch. Red, she cried in a strangled whisper. You can't. Oh, but I can, I said. What have I got to lose? But as I was saying, I returned my attention to Stephen and Samar. They were staring at me, jaws dropped, eyes wide, as frozen as Flash had been not long ago. We're dreaming, Stephen murmured, right? At the same time, Samar asked, is that possible? Pinch me, Stephen said. Samar complied. Definitely felt that, Stephen reported. Maybe it was a dream pinch, Samar suggested. Excuse me, I interrupted. I have 216 rings worth of wisdom to convey and not much time. Stephen reached for Samar's hand. If it's a dream, he said, at least it's a cool one. And so I began.